Hello friends, in this video, I will tell you steps to create dynamic web project with Maven development environment in Eclipse IDE. For that purpose, very first we need to create the dynamic web project. For creating the dynamic web project, you click on the file menu. After clicking the file menu, select the new option. In the new option, you will get one option for dynamic web project. In case the dynamic web project option is not available in this window, you can click on the other option. When you click the other option, you will get one window that is select a wizard window. In this window, find out web category, expand the web category. After expanding the web category, find out the dynamic web project option. Click on this dynamic web project option. After selecting the dynamic web project option, click the next button. Once you click the next button, you will get one window. In this window, you have to specify the project name. So here, under the project name, you write the name of the project. For example, I am writing Hello Web App. After writing this Hello Web App, make sure that the target runtime, any uh, web server is present over here. In case the web server is not present, click the new runtime button and specify the web server. After specifying the web server, you click on next button. After clicking the next button, again you can click on the next button and then you click on the finish button. After clicking the finish button, you will get your dynamic web project in this project explorer window. If you want, you can expand it so that you can make sure that the dynamic web project is created. Now, this dynamic web project should be configured for Maven development environment. And for that purpose, you right click on the project. When you right click on the project window, you will get one option here. That option is configure. Once you select this configure option, in this configure option, you will get one option in which convert to maven project is written so you select this convert to maven project when you click on the convert to maven project one window is shown to you in this window you have to first specify the group id as we know group id is actually a group id that identifies our project uniquely across all the project and in the group id generally we write inverse of the domain name so i am writing over here let us say the domain name is sergey.com so i am writing here com dot sergey after specifying the group id you should specify the artifact id and we know the artifact id is actually the jar file name without version so here i would like to keep the jar file name same as the project name so i am keeping the artifact id hello web app after this you can specify the name for your project i am keeping the project name same as the artifact id so i am writing hello web app and then in the description you can write the description for your project for example i am writing project to print hello after specifying all this information you can click on the finish button now click the finish button after clicking the finish button, you click here, skip dependency conversion button. After clicking this button, the project will be created. This is the dynamic web project that is using the Maven development environment. Now you can see over here that under the hello web app, that is dynamic project, pom.xml file is present. In the pom.xml file, you can specify the dependency that is required in your application in this way we can create the dynamic web application that is using maven development environment in this way we can create the dynamic web application that is using maven development environment thanks for watching this video